everyone. Today we're going to be playing with some more Lush cocktails, although I don't know if like bath art or Lush combos might be more appropriate because the last video that I did I cut them all up and put them in a sieve and it was a proper like cocktail. With these ones I don't have a bunch of stuff that I cut up but I did combine different things that I thought might work nicely together. I wanted to make some kind of summer inspired bath combinations using Lush products, especially using some of the bath oil melts because I'd never used one of them myself before. I'd seen them in shops and stuff and the gold one I remember thinking like that would make a beautiful sun in like a sky, a sky bath, a bath sky. <laughs> Hopefully I don't sound completely doolally but I wanted to make some summery bath art stuff. Lush sent me some new product releases the other day and there's only three things in this box, one of which I've already spoken about, but the two bath products that are kind of cool, I didn't know if you'd be disappointed if I made a video and it was just two products, but let me know what you think, I'm happy to make a video about them if you would like to see one. Even if you don't intend to buy and combine this stuff yourself, I hope you enjoy watching this video. If you do want to buy all the products that I use to make these three bath combos then uh, all of them together came to about £22, something like that. Now let us begin the bath art. Go. So first up we have Ickle Baby Bot. And yes, this is a book. <laughs> um, my chopping board is gross and I don't think it's good enough for my bath bomb. <laughs> Not that I'm probably even gonna cut this one up. I don't think I need to cut him up and I think it'll be cuter just to, you know, let him go as he is, a cute little robot. So Ickle Baby Bot contains gentle lavender to relax children before bedtime. This is a bath bomb designed to look after young children's delicate skin and this is so gentle it's suitable for babies over six months. Ooh, I didn't know that. Babies can get in on the lush action now. <laughs> its aromatherapy oils also work to soothe ir irritable cherubs before bedtime. Lavender. <laughs> Lavender is a calming aromatherapy oil used in traditional medicine to treat skin irritations, sunburn and insect bites. And what I thought would be really lovely with that for the summertime was one of these. These are my new obsession, by the way. I think they're called bath oil melts or something. It might be wrong, I don't know. I'll write it on the screen if I'm wrong. I think I checked these out in person once at the Lush Oxford Street store. But it's so busy in there and it was such a hot day that I just, I wasn't appreciating them as much as I could have. I've never tried them in a bath yet, so I won't rave about them too much, but I just keep sniffing them. And they look so pretty, all of them. I just keep looking at them and sniffing them. And I love the packaging, it's so cute. Anyway, I thought that this could look really pretty with dun, 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 this one. This is called, uh... Flowers Barrow, Brightening Roman Chamomile Oil, Geranium Oil and Black Currant Absolute. And it's covered in rose petals. I also thought I could perhaps just scrape the gold off of the top of Karma. So we also have some like gold flecks. I'm kind of being inspired by, you know, Pocahontas's wind friend that follows her around in the film. There's all the petals and the leaves. And in the scene where Grandmother Willow is singing to her, there's some gold little speckles going through the wind as well. So envision with me, we have a beautiful summer's day, rose petals blowing in the wind, sparkly gold Pocahontas leaf friends, spirits. What more could you want? <laughs> okay, let's try it out. I love all the little petals. The green of the um, bath melt actually made it more of a mint 
colour and it looks beautiful. You can see the gold glitter but it's kind of hard to get it on camera so I have to go really close up. Sorry if I look a bit greasy. I have baths when I'm greasy and dirty, so I guess I'm probably going to be greasy and dirty in a lot of these clips, actually. <laughs> this one's really simple. It's inspired by beautiful blue summer skies and the bright shiny sun. This is literally just two products that I thought would be cool together. <laughs> I'm going to use the blue skies and white fluffy clouds bubble balm. Is it white fluffy clouds or fluffy white clouds? I'm not sure, I feel like I always jumble the name up somehow. This is one of my favourite bubble bars and bath products and possibly Lush products altogether. It smells so like refreshing. It reminds me of like the seaside or of being by the ocean in the summer and everything's all blue and fresh. Then when we have our blue sky and clouds, I'm going to pop in this bath oil melt which is called Ginger and this is going to be our sun and hopefully it will look really cool. They actually had one called Sun, but it wasn't quite so gold, it looked a bit darker, and I wanted a really like gold, gold one. So that's it, it's very simple. This is melting on my fingers. My fingers are all blue and gold. So let's go, let's try it out. I'm trying to sculpt some clouds right now. Come on, look cloudy for me. This feels a bit weird. What am I doing? This is the last one I have for you today. This one I think I'm gonna call Summer Nights because it's inspired by summer night skies. Well, that's the idea anyway. Hopefully, hopefully what's in my brain is gonna translate well into the bath. Fingers crossed. Uh, the first thing I'm gonna use is the Karma Bubble Bar. I bloody love the smell. Love the smell of Karma so much and then I might add a little bit of the Big Bang bubble bar just to kind of make it a bluey purple kind of sky. <laughs> then perhaps this is a bit much, I don't know, but I'm gonna use two bath oil melts in one bath. I felt like both of them would be really nice in this bath and I couldn't decide between them and I thought what the hell I'm doing it for a video, I'll go all out try and make it as nice as possible. This first one I chose to be the moon in the summer night sky. This is delight. It's silver and it's shiny and it's beautiful and it's going to be our moon. And then to be our beautiful evening blossom that is going to be blowing through our lovely purpley shimmery summer night sky. Hopefully, in theory, <laughs> we have, what's this called? Furs? Furs? Furs. 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 <laughs> How would you pronounce it? I don't know. I'm really, really excited to use this one. Look at it. It's so cute and so pretty. Right, let's try it. Let's give it a go, shall we?
so that was all of them. I hope that you found this interesting. Ooh. I've just got to include a quick extra bit to this video because I posted a, a picture of one of the baths on Instagram and it's made me so happy because so many of you are saying it looks like the sky. It looks like the sky, it looks like the sky, looks like a photoshopped sky. I thought the bath water was the sky at first, so hallelujah. That's exactly what I was going for and you don't even know it. How cool is that? I think that means I officially succeeded. Before I go, I wanna give a quick shout out to my girls, my $30 patrons. Thank you so much to Lauren, Maya, and Kirsty. It's thanks to my patrons that I've had enough money to create a bunch of things that will be coming out soon. I say a bunch of things, I'm not gonna have like loads of stuff all at once. I will have some things for sale soon. Little Doe is coming back. It's gonna be Little Doe slash my merch. Like if you've ever wanted some merch from me, something that kind of reflects what we do here, <laughs> our vibe here. This is gonna be what you're interested in. It's taken me a little bit longer than I had like anticipated, but I had no idea how to predict how long it would take. Like I, you can't hurry like inspiration and creativeness and things. So I've just been like working on stuff for a while now. And I, th I think I've got some pretty cool ideas, some pretty cool things that I'm excited to show you. Thank you for watching and I will speak to you again soon. Bye-bye.